Hi guys, today we're doing episode one of Star Trek Online Starfleet Faction. I'm doing Star Trek fa Faction because because I thought it would be a good start to start with the Starfleet Faction. After I double with with my Starfleet character, it will move on to Romulan. Once I done Romulan, we'll move up to Klinger. Then, uh, uh, okay, and same as with the with the specialities. First, we'll go with tactical, then science, then engineering. But for Starfleet, I'm going with science, and then we'll go with tactical and then engineering. So we will have so we will have two from two different choices after when I done this character. So let's start and let an I let's go to the character creation. Okay, I decided to be a Vulcan because I like Vulcans and they are really um, logical creatures. But sorry about Earth, I don't have my graphics that good. So sorry about the about the texture of of Earth especially. So yes, let's go to our appearance. Okay, our uniform will be from I thought of Odyssey. Let's see how this will look. Yes, I thought of that. Odyssey, like if you watch Stargate, then you would know that Odyssey is dead deadless. Yes, one of the one of really um really like overpowered ships yeah so if you if you don't want these you can make your own go to head you're gonna do head time to i'll go with five yes yes perfect base complete I'll, yeah, free, free, free will be fine. Oh, scars! Never seen these. Where's the scar even? <laughs> There's no scar. No. No. Let's just leave this pointed. This or this. I don't. I don't want to be a new. I don't want to be an idiot having pointed two. So I'll go with pointed one. Yes. Oh, jeez. Uh, uh. Oh, this is a hard choice. No, nope, I don't want to be bored. I never. Oh yes, yes, yes. Okay, we'll be a. Uh, I thought and I very thought to be an old man in this. Have a nice beard. No, not this. No, 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 no. Full trim, yes. Make this color white. White. And sorry guys, but if but I I I am gonna go with white hair. I'm gonna go with these type of eyes and some. Yeah, looks more looks more effective to my vocal character. Nope, I don't like that. Or have them outside, yes. Good. No, I will greenish inside, yes, good. And then white hair. My favorite. <laughs> Alright. Now to the background. Into the I thought to be Spark. Besides <laughs> never talk to Ryan.
forget what she said. She, I, I don't. It's her friend is 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 Ryan Chapel. Yeah, Ryan Chapel. Uh, he bullies her. So. Oh no. Spot quick work. Hi, baby. Okay, it'll go away. Bad then. No, no, don't go to my Don't go to my piece, I'm just gonna go. God, this is hard. It's hard to take out the Alvi. I will be. Space in the Where will Tony work now? Fred, please? No. Alright. Uh, this is so hard, guys. Guys, I can't, I really can't do this, um, I don't know which one to use. I will be... No. I don't get this. Not gonna be silent, not gonna be... USS Odd A No, no, I I can USS Well they use the name of my ship Dennis My Robin Never mind, okay Let's go with USS USS Transporter No <laughs> XD uh, let's do this USS USS has has a beard. No. USS Origin Dead, please. Mercy. Oh yeah. Okay. USS USS Star. No, Let's think about it. USS. USS. No, I'm just going to be going with. I have called Prometheus and this will be. Oh my goodness, it's not gonna be messy. Is this USS Attack USS 
No way. Okay then, we'll go with... Yes, Prometheus. Engage. Finally, guys, we made it. Okay. I just gotta check if I'm recording. Yes, I am still recording. Okay. Thank you for using Ark. I always use Ark. No, I'll play from here. Okay, let's do this. After I left Starfleet, I made it my life's work to reunite the Romulans with their Vulcan brothers. For many years, I lived among them and waged the campaign of peace. Live long. 21 years ago, the star of the Hobus system went supernova and sent a wave of devastation across the quadrant. I promised to save the Romulan homeworld. I failed. This is Spock speaking. The planets Romulus and Remus were destroyed. Countless billions were killed. My home, my friends, my life, all are memories. Time does not stop for one man, and neither does history. The chaos in Romulan space gave the Klingon Empire an opportunity to expand its territory. Jim Pak, the Chancellor of the High Council, traded diplomacy for the tip of a blade. Only in battle, Jim Pak says, is a Klingon truly Klingon. The Federation did its utmost to preserve its alliance with the Klingons, but war was inevitable. Romulans want revenge for their lost world. The Dominion is rebuilding its forces. Now the Borg have reappeared, and the Alpha Quadrant balances on the edge of ruin. The fate of the galaxy rests in your hands. Yes, in my hands. The pro intro is just epic. The Romulan one is very epic. Back at the Star Trek Online, today is a graduation day, and you soon will be embarking on your training cruise, where the bulk of the ship is man, man, manned by cadets like yourself. All right, let's do it. Doctor Cadet Alyssa Flores. Finally, I was beginning to think you forgot what today was. Finally, I was beginning to forget. Of course, I was first in line. Oh, before I forget, I think Rasky is just ahead. He wanted to thank you for helping me cram for the astrometrics one. Yeah, we're genius, I think. Then continue. Locate Razik. Hey, Razik. Talk to There you are. I wanted to thank you for helping me pass that final, and for all the other times you've helped me. I've always admired you. I hope Starfleet recognizes all I'm you've done to lead our class. Prime what ship did you get? I haven't received my assignment yet. Good luck. Before you report to Lieutenant Farron get your assignment, you should find Tavral. She wanted to talk to you. She's just up the pathway. Thank you. Let's go. With shift like you do it. W, you move W, D, S, A. Unless you want to go with the arrow keys. Up arrow keys, forward, no. No, so you can't move left or right, only. When you go to me, you can be like a first person. I like the first person when it's combat, not like in, not like walking when it's peaceful. And especially the academy. Greetings. It was good of you to encourage me to retake the linguistics final. I was willing to accept my original results, but you saw that I was not at my best that day. My score increased by 12.8% on the second attempt, well within my standard norms. Nice. Now I am qualified to serve as both a science officer and a communications officer. Nice. Morik would like to see you as well. 
He is ahead of us on the path. Live long and prosper. Live long and prosper, Cadet, Cadet Tavrell. Cadet Morag. Ah, yeah, there we go. They also have some icon above the table. There you are. Getting excited yet? Once we finish our training cruise, we'll all be full-fledged ensigns. The buzz is, Captain Taggart hasn't named all of his senior staff yet. From what I heard, the advanced phaser training simulation is tripping people up. Thanks. Locate Lieutenant Fair. That's a cat, I guess. After I don't want to select. Right. Hello, Lieutenant Farah. Good afternoon, Cadet. What can I do for you? Is, is this where I get my training crew's assignment? Yes. I have the complete assignment list here. Name? Prometheus. Let's see. Interesting. Report to Captain Taggart. He's in the office behind me. Is there a problem? You're going to have to ask him. Oh, dear. I think we're in trouble, guys. People that already played Star Trek, you probably, you probably know that it, you know the answer is going to happen. Come. There it is, Captain Thomas. See, my graphics are very, very, very ridiculous. I, I was just new, so I messed up the graphics a bit. So, we'll live. Won't we, guys? We'll live. Good at. You asked, you asked to see me, sir. I did. I've been following your progress here at the Academy. And I must say, I'm impressed. Thank you, Captain. Thank you, Captain. I'm just looking at your final test scores. But I don't see your results for the advanced phase of training program. But we have, we have two choices. This one, many of my classmates didn't take the test either, Captain. Is that an issue? Or I'm not a tactical officer. I concentrated on courses for my career track. Oh, I am a nice person. I want everyone on my senior staff to run that program. And I want to see good results. No exceptions. Did you say senior staff? I did. Like I said, I've been following your career here at the Academy. If you complete that program, I can put you on my bridge. I'll ask my tactical officer to set it up. Your tactical officer? Who is that? Another fine cadet like yourself. Her scores were almost as good as yours, but her record has a few... blemishes. Still, I'm sure Cadet Flores will settle down and become a fine officer someday. I'll tell nice. Flores to meet you out in the quad. Talk to her to start the phaser training, and I'll see you when you're finished. You're dismissed, cadet. Yes, sir. Wow, I never knew I, I never knew Elisa Flores was a tr was an officer. A senior staff. Well, she probably isn't, but I don't know. Ah oh, jeez. No wait. I'm getting lost now. I I know where to go. But I I can't just follow I can't just I got the tactical <laughs> officer spot. Just what I wanted. Where'd you end up? <coughs> Captain Target says he wants me on the senior staff, but I have to pass an advanced phase of training first. You never did that? I thought you were Mr. Extra Credit. Everyone knows that Captain Tiger expects all his top people to pass that program. Now you tell Don't me- Don't worry, you'll do fine. Come on, I'll take you to the holodeck and set it up. Follow this up to the holodeck. Lead the way. Let's do this. Seems most of our class ended up on Captain Taggart's ship. Yes, because we're the best. Have I you am. seen the whales in San Francisco Bay? I'm, I never seem to spot them. I'm be I'm better than you, really. I, I sometimes forget I'll give that my ship is a hologram. In, in he like, seems like such a like in minute, fixture here at Starfleet Academy. Just because I I know what's going to happen. I can't really say it. Last one of the console buys the first round. No! Time. No! I was already! Hey, get back, get back! Get. No! No, I'm gonna be my girl. 
You broke this cable, gaming. You suck. You got beat by a girl. I am just a player character, but I can speak to you. Setting up the training program now. I hope Holodeck 2 is your lucky holodeck. Phasers are in the lockers by the holodecks. You can grab one there. Let's go. Run for your life. Hey, move it. Move it. Move it, you slow person. Move it. Move, you slow idiot. Go, you can't, you can't, you can't even run. Only when, when you're told to. There we go. Oh, darn it, we can't find it. Now this is combat time, maybe. But now this is... Sorry, I said babies, I don't know. Target! I know he's my target because he's a clay gun! I thought a dog, by the way. Oi! 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 Get back here! Oi! Yes. Go away. Okay. I'll get out of here. Bye. Ooh, yes. I passed. I win. Well done, cadets. You're not going to break the Academy record, but your score was more than satisfactory. Thank you, Captain. Do you have an assignment for me now? Absolutely. I have a new first officer. Congratulations. Yes, you should be proud of your accomplishments here, Cadet. You have a promising career ahead of you in Starfleet. Thank you, sir. It will be an order serving with you. Yes. First officer, way to go. Just a little jealous, I'll admit. <laughs> At least now you'll get to boss us all around like you've always wanted. Don't let it go to your head, buddy. You'll do great, but we should head up to the shuttle bay. Everyone else is waiting there for the ceremonial send-off toast. Go to the shuttle bay. Let's do this! Turn around. Now, hear this. All cadets report to shuttle bay to prepare for departure. Don't talk to me like that. <laughs> I'm your first officer, Academy. Your first officer of the academy, okay? All the senior staff is waiting by the bar. I know Vulcans don't get nervous, but the rest of us do, and this is our first real assignment. Oh, how do you have a Vulcan? Oh, because my ears, right? And my hands. I have no feelings at all. Yeah, everyone's attention. Begin your speech. Having been one of your classmates for the past four years, I have had an ample opportunity to study your reactions in many different situations. As your first officer, it is logical that I use this information to best instruct you on how to carry out your orders. We will, op we will operate effic efficiently and eff effectively. I ask no more of you that I ask myself. Raise a class to the class to the class of two zero two four oh nine. Well cadets, please board your shuttles. Shut up, I'm doing my toast. Follow me to the shuttle. Dr. Kent. Yep. I can't I, I can't read this all these guys. They're all mine. Hopefully. Let's do this! Okay, our uh, shuttle master. Hey, give me a shuttle, you idiot. Are you ready to head to the ship? Let's go. Lift the guard. Really?
That looks creepy already. It's not my stuff. I can't believe we're finally doing this. Don't be, don't get too excited. <sighs> Look at that. USS Vesta, first of her class. She's got subsystem targeting, a crew of 750, a okay, we'll laser cannons, and even a quantum field focus controller. I can't wait to captain one someday. But here's our ship. No! Miranda class, no way. 200 crew, two forward weapon mounts, one aft, average You're speed, kidding, or launch. five point nothing. She is a tough little ship, though. I think I like her. I don't get you. We're the final shuttle to arrive. We need to get to the bridge. Oh my gosh! I don't understand her. She she likes the the Vesta class, but now she likes the Marinda class. I don't get her at all. I'm going to check in and then head for the bridge. See you there. I, I, I'll be there first. I'll be the first. Get out. Get out. No, I'll be there first. Name and position? I have your record right here, sir. Welcome to the ship. Captain Taggart is waiting for you on the bridge. Use the turbo lift behind me. It Bye, suckers. Oh, I am, at the, I am first to go. Bye. Doctor Captain Talk. That's that's what you call a ship. Okay. I think this is tack this is navigation. This should be hell. Or if this is tactical and this is wait no. Alright, this is tactical where Florence is on. This is this is communications. This is, I don't know, I don't know what, I think this is engineering. Yes, I think so. Welcome to the bridge, number one. Um, Early in my career, I served with a captain who called his first officer that. I always liked it. As my number one, I expect you to ensure my orders are carried out and to advise me on the best course of action in any situation. But first, we need to get out of dry dock. Get clearance from- Earth traffic control has cleared us to depart, sir. Very good, number one. Shuttle bay doors are closed, sir. Very good, number one. Potter, wait for me to disable the tractor moorings. Release tractor moorings. So, what, I do it? Hey, you. I can't do this at all. Why are you forcing? Why are you forcing me to do this? Find that. There you go. Target. Taggart. Potter, take us out. One quarter impulse. Just checking to see if you were paying attention, number one. Potter, take us out. Maximum thrusters. Okay, right at the click of the chair. There we go. Let's do this. From dry dock, Captain. Good. Let's start with something easy. Set course for Vulcan. My home planet. Woo! Course lead in, sir. Engage. So that will sound probably. Captain. I am picking up a distress call from the SS Breakeven. Audio only. Let's hear it, Tavrell. This is the SS Breakeven. Our warp core is failing, and we are in need of assistance. Oh, Let them know we're on our way. Potter, lay in a rendezvous course. Altering course, sir. ETA three minutes. Transporter room, prepare to beam over survivors. Sir, sensors can't read anything in the vicinity the of the Breakeven. Communications are out as well. Keep trying to help them, Tavrell. Number one, let's discuss the situation.
Oh, you have the distress call number one. What do you think we should do? Absolutely not. We're the closest ship to the break even, so it's our duty to assist. It's strange that the transmission was out here early. A warp commercial should affect communications. Good. What do you advise? Raising the shields does seem to be a reasonable precaution. Yes, sir. It could be a trick. I agree. Flores, raise shields. Number one, get down to the transporter room. You'll oversee the rescue effort from there. Alright then. I bet it's a trap. Seriously, me too. With the, that the Klingons will board. I literally bet that. I don't know why. I'm just, just strange. Alright, Becky, we should be in range. Give me an update. I'm getting some weird readings. I can't get a solid lock. There may be interference. Trying to compensate. I think I have it. This is a lot different than the training scenarios. Beaming them over now. Klingons! This vessel is it. now property of Captain Kader of the IKS Chot. Rag, come in! What happened? Rag! Security is reporting disruptor fire in the transporter room, and Klingon transporter signatures are showing up all over the ship. They're boarding us. What could I do to help? You have the command codes to unlock an armory near your position. Arm yourself, and any security team members you find. Get a first one from the arm. Uh, what about uh, the enemy ship, sir? We still have weapons. I'll do what I can. For now, so now I, I need, need you to, to concentrate on getting those Klingons, Klingons off my, my ship. ship. Tag us out. out. Okay, let's do this. Oh god, it's shaking already. Ridiculous, I shot you up two times. Stabilizing. Repel click on board at seventy one percent.
go, then we'll flag you guys. better to hear me. Did did four of it. Okay. Weapons are ready. Defeat them. Okay. Oh no! No! Oh crap. Kill him! Kill him! Kill him! Fire! Wow! Flanker. Oh, Flores, up to you. Ugh. No, Raziki, Raziki. Oh, you both. Okay. Oh, Terrell. Oh, gosh. Okay. Rescuate. Incoming transmission from the Klingons. All screen. This is Captain Kayak of the IKS Chart. You may have forced my boarding parties off your decks, but our ship remains cloaked. You have no hope of finding us or defeating us. Your choice is simple. Surrender, or we will kill your captain and then destroy your ship. Never! Perhaps your captain will change. Captain? Order your crew to surrender, Captain, or I will blow them out of the sky. It's your choice, Captain. Do you want these children to die? Very well. Very well, he said. Number one. You are now the captain of the ship. Your orders. Orders are to look onto my combat and fire! No! No. Make me proud. Oh dear. We have target lock, Captain. Fire! Okay, that's so cool. I'm gonna kill him. I'm gonna kill him. Kill my friends. Gonna screw his shit. Wow, dude. We've lost their signal. What now? Speak to Elisa Flores. There's only a small shield to charge. We, we survived. But the captain, Captain Tiger, knew what happened. And he gave the order anyway. Well, to make some questions. Well, in fact, we all might be called to make Sunday, and he trusted you to take command. All we can do now is survive and remember him. Take a seat in the captain's chair. This is not the. There you go, fly. 
so this should be fine. Let's see. Okay. Sink cartridge. Right. Yeah, we are still recording. Elisa Freyres, species given. Staffy tactical. Okay, we will take her. Talk to you first off. All decks reporting in, sir. We took some casualties, and sick bay is full. All I have been trying to get a distress call out, Captain, but something is jamming all frequencies. Keep trying, El Elisa. What's the status of our good ship? She's still cloaked, but I think she took some real damage. We're in rough shape too, Captain. Several damage reports. Still running diagnostics, sir. Took us some time to get the systems back online. What about break even? Hail them, Tavrell. Hailing the break even now, Captain. This is break even. This is Starfleet vessel. USS Prometheus. What is your status? Oh, um, hello, Starfleet. No hard feelings, right? I had to send that distress signal. If I didn't, that crazy Klingon was going to blow my ship into space junk. And, um, because Starfleet's always ready to help and all, uh, could you help me repair my ship? Uh, I oh, that, that little... I know, I know, I done the tutorial. Actually, I did this. I play, I played this episode, episode anyway. I mean, I did, I did. This. Helm, full stop. I've stopped us this time, sir. But from Shut now up. on, you'll be responsible for adjusting the speed of the ship. Looks like she just needs three or four warp induction coils. We have plenty of those to spare. Thanks! We'd help you if we could, but I just don't see any profit in that, you know? Wow. Wow, idiots. Left us to die, eh? Well, looks like we're on our own. At least they said thank you, I guess. About that cloaked ship full of Klingons? Almost done, Captain. Level 2 diagnostics shows that almost all of the plasma injectors are damaged beyond repair. Not enough. Plasma injectors. We're not the first. Oh, let's see. Bingo! I found some suitable debris in the boneyard nearby. Destroy three of those nacelles, and we should get the parts we need. Oh, uh, aye aye. Sir, gorgeous technology. Type R, if I had to guess. 3.7 liter flow put with shielded reservoirs and a drop flow induction coil. You have your problems, I have mine. Zarva's dealing with the warp core. Okay, of yeah. course. Let's get on with this. Send the distress signal. That Klingon ship took some real damage. I'll bet she's leaking plasma all over the place. Understood. I'd rather not die to Klingons on my first day. Got it. I can trace the plasma signature right to the source. I'll send the source of the plasma signature to navigation. It'll show up on the map. It's pretty far out, sir. We should use the ship's full impulse power to reach it. 
This will temporarily take power from other systems, but vastly improve our speed. Once we drop out of full impulse, the power will return to other systems. I can't make your depth swift! Transmission, sir. It is from Starfleet. This is Captain Volok of the USS Renown. Do you require assistance? A Klingon captain would have to be very bold to travel this far into Federation territory. Where is Captain Taggart? Take. And did you follow his orders? So, I take it you are in command now. Oh, yes, I am. Very well. We will escort your ship to Earth's space dock. And if he reveals his position, he will be dealt with accordingly. Until then, you are to set a course for our position. Screw you. I'm the fit I got. Escort you back to Earth 
space dock. But first we must inform the USS Kittimer that... One moment. My community... Yes, soft records. Exit to sector space. Okay guys, this was it for today. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed this episode really. Of Star Trek Online. Okay guys, we're in sector space. This is online, so you can join me if you want. Thank you guys for watching. See you in the next episode. Live long and prosper. Live well and prosper.